Never know what you're going to see around San Francisco, but we're not going to see rain for a while. Or you're hoping <laughs> probably, probably not. not. Probably not. Not yeah. around San Francisco, but south of San Francisco, maybe Friday maybe. night, Saturday. What's the big? But maybe. you've seen Keanu, right? Oh, I saw him there six times. <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, we are looking at uh, clouds increasing over the Bay Area, and then the numbers are going to warm up with uh, temperatures climbing back into the 70s for late February, which is just insanity, but that's weather lately. As we look outside tonight, we've got a few clouds painting the horizon out there as we look toward the west. And uh, the numbers right now, fairly warm. Concord 65 degrees, Oakland 64, and Livermore at 63 degrees. San Francisco is uh, relatively chill by comparison at 57. And here's what's happening. High temperatures uh, today. We're four to five degrees above average, so it continues warm in the Bay Area, except tonight, of course, when it'll get down to uh, 36 degrees in Santa Rosa and 42 in San Jose, 39 out at Livermore and 38 degrees for uh, Fairfield out at Travis Air Force Base. So high pressure will be building in over the next few days. Low up in the Gulf and a low out there over the uh, Basin Range Province. The high will build a bit, and then by the time we get to Friday, one low plunges off the coast. Watch what happens. Uh, clear night tonight. But as we head into Thursday, so here's Thursday a little bit before sunrise. Clouds during the day begin to increase tomorrow. That'll make for a nice sunset tomorrow night. There's Thursday about 24 hours from now. So yeah, some clouds over the Bay Area. And then watch on Friday. More clouds come up. You know how they're coming from the south and up over the Bay Area. One thing that is not happening in the future cast is anything that is suggesting even a drop. Nevertheless, this is just a computer, and we being human beings like to say, well, wait a minute, I remember when this happened, and we did get a few drops. So at the moment, we're keeping in a bit of a chance, and only a bit of one in San Jose. Unusually, this system is forecast to drop some rain down on the central coast, so south of the Bay Area, instead of like north of the Golden Gate, as per usual, uh, for tomorrow. And that's, by the way, Friday night. That's not tomorrow night. High temperature, but we're so excited about it. High temperatures, San Francisco for tomorrow, 64 degrees. It'll be about three degrees above uh, average for this time of the year. Oakland, ditto. Well, Oakland's even warmer, 66. San Jose at 70 degrees. Concord tomorrow at 67. So we continue with the unusually high temperatures around the Bay Area. And for tomorrow, Santa Clara will skyrocket to 69 degrees. You know, it's warmer now than it often is in July, close to the shoreline of the Bay Area. Temperatures will be in the mid 60s. 65 at uh, San Mateo, 63 at Hayward, and in Milpitas, 69 degrees. It's uh, Fairfield, 68 at Antioch, 66 degrees tomorrow. Hazy sunshine and 66 for Walnut Creek and for San Ramon and for Dublin. Up in the North Bay, we'll get some fog forming overnight. Not a lot, but uh, take note. Uh, 68 degrees in Novato then, and hazy sunshine, increasing clouds toward the end of the day, but actually sunnier in the North Bay than in the South Bay tomorrow, by tomorrow evening. And then high temperatures for Ukiah, 67 degrees, 64 over at Clear Lake. In the extended forecast, we're going to be looking for the numbers to warm over the next couple of days. It's going to warm even though we've got clouds coming in. Everything is topsy-turvy. Then by Saturday and Sunday, the numbers begin to fall. Rain falling, if it happens, would be Friday night into Saturday. It would favor the South Bay. And then Sunday, we'll go to variable clouds. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, it is all sunny side up. That's what's coming up for weather.